the game is currently on the wrong monitor, but that's fine. Well, I'll try and move my stuff to where it should be while the intro is going. Not one to zero. Okay, I don't know where it is now. Okay, so the monitor has changed its name apparently. Need to go over a little bit more. Sorry. There, I'll do. Okay. This is the request. All our requests in are in Sapporo jail. So let's go to Sapporo. And I can play as Joker because everyone has learned their things. So I just need to swap out the party now and then to get them levels. <sighs> oh, jeez. I should write something. You should. Oh, let's just explore it. Enemies of Queen. Go ahead. Okay, got it. You won't get away. Right where we want you. Come on. Well, that was too easy. Request down. Castle front. Trees. Here's hoping the next one's we need a checkpoint, really. I'll reveal your true form.
so it's in an area surrounded with trees. My guess is gonna be the place where you get on the snowboard. Huh? That looks suspicious. Huh. I guess it's not a total waste. Like up here. One of these places. Okay, where to now? <laughs> Easier than cleaning a paintbrush. Apply the same effort in the next battle. I feel inspired. Ah, oh, yeah, here we go. Oh, we're all to my place. To the checkpoint. This place is perfect for an ambush. Fuck it. Why not? Show me your moves. An easy win, don't you think? Save as well. Okay, let's not waste any time. Now then. Honestly. <laughs> Honestly. I 
can't see. Morgana! Thank you. 
Okay. Thank you. Come. I'll use this. Sorry. Jesus, I've got so much. Just add this. Okay, good work, people. All the requests are done. I oh. should write something. I should. Here's what I found. You're already working on this one. Good job! You're already working on this one. Good job! You're already Sweet. working on this one. Incredible! Whoa, look at this watermelon. Looks like I've got my hands full, right? Now I need to make sure I can crack it open cleanly so everyone can have some. Care to get started? Oh, well, what about the stick? Speaking of which... Well, when I was in the jail, I realised something. Rather than with a weapon I'm not as familiar with, like a stick, I figured my fist might give us better results. Now I'm nice and warmed up thanks to that jail excursion. I feel like I could split it right down the middle now. Whoa. So bold. If I managed to break it into acceptable pieces, would you help me pass them out to the rest of the group? Of course you can claim the best piece first. <laughs> After all, you put the most effort into helping with my request. Okay, I'll let you know when I'm ready. Count my spins for me when it's whacking time, right? Mission accomplished. Hmm. Just add this. Let's go see Morgana then. Because we've done all the requests, <laughs> right? This is the request. Actually, let's go talk to Waifu. Just in case. Hey! It's gonna be sent soon. She started the bed. Just save next to Morgana then. 
Now then. Hmm? Why don't you be on this point? What if that's not suspicious? But do you think it has anything to do with the research lab? And with the sun setting soon, going alone may be overly risky. That's true. Should we call everyone else over then? Sure. Leave it to me. Okay, I'll contact everyone. No entry beyond this point? Uh, I wonder what for. I admit, it only contributes to the mysterious vibe here. Oh, looks like a dare to me. Come on, who's willing to go the farthest past it? Nope, this is the end of the line. There's an Utaki down that way. See, there, on the sign? What's an Utaki? Basically, it's a land that's been considered holy since the Ryukyu era. People used to believe the gods lived there, or at least came to work there. Locals still revere the places, even today. Going down there for a laugh could get you in real trouble. Oh, I've never heard of that stuff here. I'm surprised you know all that. Well, Investigation 101 says to know your territory. Feel free to keep buttering me up, though. Does that mean there are Ryukyu era customs still being practiced today? Yep. Reverence of the incomprehensible is ingrained deep in human consciousness. Well, I'm sure you have no interest in pissing off a god today. Let's all listen to the sign and get out of here. How mystical. I checked online for any relevant information, but this place does not appear to have any real significance. The other subjects here are far more interesting, such as the shape of the coastline, the sounds of the waves crashing, and the oceanic life form. A person's values can affect what makes an impact on them. It might be insignificant to you, but to others, this place may be very sacred. It depends on my values. My apologies. Inari stomach, right on time as always. Well, I'm starving too. We all worked up an appetite out there. Should we finally kick off our long-awaited barbecue? Stir. Oh, uh, hell yeah! Time for an Okinawan meat festival! Don't forget the curry! We gotta make some tropical edition LeBlanc curry! Uh, that's not exactly barbecue food. Also, do you already have curry on the ferry? Hmm, I accept your challenge. Curry will be a perfect complement to the searing white sands of this tropical paradise. That makes no sense at all. Seriously, what is with you two and curry? Hey. What's up? Thank you for earlier, when you gave me the underwater tour. It was a fascinating experience, and something no AI could ever do on their own. I guess you could say it made my heart feel full. Although, I don't have a heart. But you do have one. It's a simple fact. There is no need to attempt to spare the feelings I lack. I am still going to try to understand what feelings are, though. I came to that realization when I first stared out at the sea. For example, being with you and the other phantom thieves, it's quite fun. Yes. Fun. Did I get that right? That's right. I got it. I understand another emotion. Okay. I've memorized what fun is. <laughs> hey, pick up the pace. We got a whole lot of cooking ahead of us. Paradise feast on the beach. Son of a beach. Oh, oh man. This meat is so good! Hey! You saw me about to grab that piece! The curry is divine as always. And with these leftovers, we're sure to dine on curry udon tomorrow. Let's ignore the fact that you're already planning tomorrow's dinner. Why not add deep fried tofu for Inari curry udon? We've been eating nothing but the most delicious food since this trip began. Traveling makes it a lot easier to lose track of one's diet. I should be more careful. Huh? But you're so toned, Makoto. Right? You're like a model. Oh, stop! I know you are just trying to flatter me, but there is an actual model here. Don't embarrass me like that. 
I mean, who cares if you've packed on a few extra pounds? It probably gives your punches some extra oomph. Want to test your theory? No, please, I don't... Hmm. What is it, Zenkichi? Upset stomach? Hmm? Oh, nah. Something bothering you? It's probably nothing. Let's wrap up. We gotta wake up early tomorrow. Okay. Hey, guys. Something's up. Yeah? What's that? Keep it down. And listen. I think... What? Oh shit. They can't be far! Find them! We have we to punish them for defiling the hollow ground! Find them! We'll, we'll make an offering out of them! Where are them. they? they what the fuck? Zenkichi hadn't picked up on what was about to happen. He said something about the filing hollowed ground. What's that supposed to mean? New tacky? Huh? It didn't actually go though. Maybe it was the lab? Remember that straw festoon we saw on the entrance? That's right. We saw it and proceeded further anyway. Hang on, hang on. What's so friggin' hollow about some lab? And even if it is hollowed, that doesn't explain how they're acting at all. They look like they want to kill us. It doesn't matter how we look at it, these people have lost their minds. Wait, could this be... Their desires were taken. And that would mean there's a monarch somewhere around here, yeah? But... Correct. I cannot smell any jails here. Oops. However, you did also say you got a bad feeling from this place. Considering our current situation, I can only assume it's due to a changing of their hearts. But nobody tried to attack us until just now. Perhaps there really is something on this island. Something even Sophia can't detect. What do we do now? They'll catch us if we just stay here. Let's go to the lab. Is that a good idea? Won't there already be brainwashed locals there? Actually, it might be smarter than it seems. What do you mean, Gramps? It's pretty obvious, based on how they treat that place, there's something fishy there. No matter where we go on this island, they'd catch us eventually. Why not strike at the heart of the matter right away? By heart of the matter, do you mean a jail? However, there is no jail. Sure there's no jail, but I'd bet we'll at least find something in their holy land. It sure sounds like a better plan than waiting in the bushes until they find us, right? Yes, it does. I've got to agree. Okay, let's head for the lab. Wait, how are we getting there without getting spotted? <laughs> what are you asking me for? Aren't you guys the phantom thieves? Well, those abilities are only relevant in the cognitive world. You just gotta go with the flow. Follow my lead. 
keep your voices down. Them, right? Yeah, looks like the coast is clear. That's surprising. I expected guards to be posted here more so than anywhere else. Wait, listen. What's this? Hide. What's he doing? I can't exactly tell from over here. This could actually be good for us. There's only one guy. If we capture him, we might be able to question him. I can help him. <laughs> Don't worry. Leave it to the professional. You're doing it by yourself, Gramps? I've been through enough training. I'll be fine. You guys just stay here and keep an eye out for any of the buddies. Holy crap! Gramps just got way cooler! Hello, excuse me? There, you all right? Not again. You totally threw him on his ass. Hey, it was clearly self defense. He truly is a member of public security. <laughs> hey, take a look at that. The sign we saw this morning. Look again. The 18th was changed to the 19th. Apparently, the facility's staff is on permanent vacation, one day at a time. Why would they do this? Most likely, to string along anyone who came to the island for the lab. When someone thinks the staff's out for the day, they probably stick around the island. Come nighttime, the locals descend on whoever got too curious to protect whatever's in there. What horrid tactics. Well, let's investigate a bit. If his heart's been changed, he should have a smartphone with eminent store. There's a chance this Ubukata is the monarch of Okinawa. Anyone got a keyword? Uh, that one's a lot tougher. Oh, hang on. There's an email here. Cordial invitation to serve as a tester of the Emma system. An Emma tester? Oh, this even has a keyword in it. Operation Oraculi? Who sent him the email? I don't recognize the address. Maybe it's from the lab? The lab asked all of these guys to be Emma testers? What now? Thanks to the email, we know the keywords Operation Oraculi. If the people who called this place hollowed had their hearts changed, then it's going to be jail related, without a doubt. But, like, we can't find the jail here, right, Sophia? I'm not sure. At the very least, I do not smell one. Let's try it anyway. He's right. If we can't get in, that'll settle it. But if there is a jail here, testing the keyword will send us right in. Are we all ready? We have no choice but to try. Our pursuers have decided our path. Yeah, even the metaverse feels safer to me than this place does now. Okay, let's do it. Emma, add Shuzo Ubukata to my friend registry. Keyword, Operation Oraculi. Uh, guess it doesn't work. Wait, I can smell a jail. The scent is already all around us. Keyword successfully entered. Beginning navigation. Beginning navigation. Oh, Zankiji's coming with us. Maybe not. Is this the lab? Oh no, he's with us. Bad vibes here, guys. This place looks straight up haunted. Uh, Queen, you all right? Uh, 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 yep, all fine here. <laughs> you sure don't sound fine. <laughs> <laughs> Screw you too, 
can. Huh? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Where are you, sis? Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so uh, sorry. Wait. I didn't know you two were. Until just now, there is a possibility that it was sleeping. Jails can sleep? Once the keyword was entered, it almost felt as if this place woke up. Ah, so you mean jails have a sleep mode? Now, this is a new wrinkle. Hmm. Why is someone calling my name? We just you left. appear to have entered quite the conundrum. <sighs> what awaits you here in these lands is an inhuman being. This is where she... She? No. I oughtn't speak any further. My duty is to witness your path laid before you by your decisions. You must witness for yourself the being I have mentioned. As for why I have called you here, a new form of persona execution is now at your disposal. You may now perform the Triad Fusion, a group execution harnessing special power. Now, uh, okay. Triad Fusions allow you to generate even more powerful personas. Please make wise use of it in preparation for the trials ahead. Farewell. Hello, Chickster. Awaken your new self. Wait, how do I do? You wish to strengthen it? Performing a fusion? How do I do a triad fusion? the entry you wish to strengthen it well I, I don't know may luck be on your side don't know there's no option for it so hmm? what's up anyways if all the people on this island got the hearts changed doesn't that mean their desires were taken we've got to get them those desires back fast we're in real danger until we do good point first we need to figure out where they're being held this really is real, isn't it? I just keep feeling like I'm losing it. Uh, sorry. But I'm gonna stick around here while you do your thing. This place is your territory, not mine. Yeah, leave it to us. This is where we take down whoever's in our way. Keep an eye out for shadows. Yes, sir. I'll keep look out here. Just a moment. Sophie? voice deeper inside what do you mean by that i can hear someone calling for me i'm going to check it out hey wait sophie let's go joker uh-oh so i'll just add this let's save so maybe if i go to the other room now there's a new option Welcome to the Velvet Room. Awaken your new self. No. I can't make anything new because I'm not high enough level. You wish to strengthen it? I, I don't know then. May luck be on your side. I can now do a triad fusion, which isn't there. Oh, Dude, Sophia's not in our party. Okay, we need someone else then. 
Let's have... Who's the lowest level? Yusuke or Arn? Let's have... Let's have Arn. She said it was a voice. Whatever it is, we have to catch What's up that? to it. Focus. What's that? What's the deal with this place? Ugh. So creepy. Are you holding up, Queen? <laughs> uh, yes, fine. Focus. Let's hurry up and find Sophie. Is that a tape recorder? <coughs> Let's see if it works. This plan brings to fruition a dream long cherished by the research team. No. By all mankind. So the tape recorder is functional. Every last test subject. A successful change of heart. Or the penitentiary system is complete. The concept of suffering will be dead. To all mankind. Now, let us rejoice and welcome the new age of humanity. Emma shall be our guide into this promised land. Emma? And changes of heart? Just as Ichinose said, there was indeed some form of experimentation on Emma here. The voice said something about a penitentiary system, too. I think I understand what they were researching here now. Yes, that would be a logical conclusion. Anyway, we'll talk more about it later. We need to track down Sophie first. Right, we have to catch up with her. Damn it, Shorty. Why'd she have to run off like that? I can see it. What's that? Hey, why is it gonna get so dark on us? It. it has grown even eerier as well. Focus. The flies and wait ahead of us. The visibility level's a real issue, but I'm still worried about Sophie. Let's proceed with caution. Careful, there's a shadow lurking around. You're safe, Sophie. I was worried. I'm sorry. You said you heard a voice, yeah? Figure out who it is yet? No. It disappeared once I arrived here. We never heard anything of the sort. So only Sophie could hear it? It was very strange. The voice sounded similar to my own. And it was calling my name. Maybe the owner of the voice knows me. How's that, Sophie? The only memory I recall before meeting Joker is the directive to become humanity's companion. I've traveled so far with you all and learned many things. But I still know nothing about myself. When I heard the voice, I thought I had found my chance to learn about me. I'm sorry for worrying you. Thanks, Joker. I've got a feeling we can learn more about you right here. Huh? What makes you say that? I've been thinking for a while now. Jails, Emma, Sophie. I keep looking for some kind of connection. We found Sophie in a jail, right? Emma was linked to that jail. And Sophie is an AI like Emma. There's no way these are all coincidences. Something has to link all three. I had hoped we'd eventually come across the answer if we investigated the jails we found. See, you believe these things have a uniting factor. Not only that, I at least kind of know what Sophie's going through. Not knowing your identity or your past, it's rough. So let's join Sophie in hunting down this mystery voice. Right there, good. Agreed. We're Sophie. Really? Thank you. Well, now we got two missions. One, take back all the locals' desires so they stop trying to kill us. And two, figure out who the hell keeps yelling at Sophie. Yeah, good idea. 
I have no objections. It's only natural for us to assist both the public and our own teammates. All right, Phantom Thieves, let's get to it. Huh. Looks like some notes on an experiment. Determining the effects of a change of heart. We ordered the island locals to eliminate anyone who comes near the laboratory without clearance. This shall test the change of heart's ability to facilitate complex commands, as well as any remaining latent consciousness. More specifically, what are the where are mortals remain? It's in me. Go. 
Is there anything that is... Black O's! I'm spinning mine. I don't see any shadows. What's that? This is a research lab for computer stuff? That's supposedly the case. This music is giving me like corpse party vibes. Human experimentation and it's Human experimentation? That would mean this place yeah. is monarch used the real facility in the same way. Yeah. That's a gross way to see shit. Containers. Mm -hmm. What do you think's inside? They appear to be roughly person sized. Oh, hello. Super powerful, they know that. Too busy looking at you complimenting me, so I missed what I got out of that chest. Did you see what it was? <laughs> okay, thanks. Um, I know. I can give Futaba like a, a health thing. Trust would be maybe this. Oh no, I don't have that yet. Probably either this or just give myself more stats. Until way later, okay. I can see it. What's that? So there's a vent, that's where it came from. Focus. 
Uh. Oh, I thought it was like cutscene. What's that? The lockpick one? Yeah. I was thinking about that as well. I've only come across like level two shit until now, but oh, checkpoint. Good time. Stop right there. Oh hey guys. Persona. Oh, these are just standard. What about you? Yep, you missed it all. She had a moment, it was uh it was alright. Oh, is that? Oh, I think we only know as Mari's son, right? Because of Haru. Is that her name? I don't even remember, man. Let's listen. It may provide us some clues uh. about the lab. Please, Director Ubukata, we must immediately abort the experiment. It's too dangerous. These are the orders I was given. If the system isn't tested on real humans. It won't ever be completed. But tricking the islanders into participating? So these guys are the ones who effed up the island. I heard a director Ubukata. I believe that means one of the speakers is Shuza Ubukata. Order says. You know what happens to a person when their desire is taken, director. Well, I can't wait. of another party manipulating the cognitive world for their own purposes <laughs> in the real one. But we cannot allow these individuals to progress beyond us. So long as we follow the divine revelation, we will attain the ideal society. I have absolute faith in the system as it was prophesied to me. What ideal society turns its entire population into slaves? This isn't any divine revelation. It's a curse. It can only lead to our destruction. The recording ends there. While still rather fuzzy, we are starting to see the big picture. Yeah. This lab was researching jails and changing people's hearts. And they used the island's residents as their test subjects. We did see that email earlier about joining the Emma test. They both mentioned a divine revelation, too. Could that have something to do with Operation Oraculi? Maybe. But how would that involve Emma? That's the million dollar question. What is Emma's role in all this? Not just that. I'm curious who was pulling this director's strings, too. Perhaps the mastermind behind this case? Are we finally be getting close to the guy? We have to find the desires first, regardless. And also track down that voice for Sophie. Let's press on. Uh, let's make sure there's no like chest chest calls or anything like What's that. that? Uh, why 
why did it let me come up here? Just for shits and giggles, I guess. So that's where we came from, yeah. Okay. Now then. Let's check the velvet room. Welcome to the velvet room. Awaken Hello. your new self. Ah, uh, not allowed. You wish to strengthen it? I mean, no, but... Just seeing what options you're gonna give me. You wish to browse the entries? Browse your entries in a minute. You wish to strengthen it? Um... Oh no, all I need to do is level... Lavenza! Ah, no way. No way to. Massey Yonga! There chosen. it is, you see that? Okay. Dodge wind. <laughs> Awaken your new self. Uh, you know it. I probably could have gone for the top down, but... Oh, can I not... How do I do a Mazionga stream, though? How do I accomplish that? Oh, I'm four now, am I? Hmm. Uh, what's the shittest one I got? Probably you. Die. Performing a fusion. Jack Frost is fucking dead. Kikariki May. That it can gain new power. New power. Choose which. Choose these nuts. You're awesome. Mazionga. God, take it. No, you're awesome. This the first. Be born anew. Be born uwu. Yeah, I don't have the uh uh levels. So that shall do for now. May luck be on your side. I'll just add this. Up my ass. Persona! I'm screaming. Unicorn! Actually, see less when he does that. Right I do. Sure. Huh. <laughs> 
day and night. <laughs> Your nan is so tight. <laughs> Don't buy. Oh, you just came. Peter Dingled. Let's keep up the pace, shall we? What's that? Focus. Huh? That looks suspicious. I can see it. Nearby shadow detected. Hi. Uh, I, I, I wish I could make an Oni at level like 2 and keep it for the whole game. Wouldn't that be great? <laughs> oh. Looks like some sort of record, but parts of it have been redacted. Now designated subject C82, assigned for experimentation for leaking confidential intel. It's not a big sigh moment, come on. You love it, really. Focus. What's that? It's a room. Another tape recorder. That makes the third one. There's a chance these things could have clues about the Islanders' desires. Or even that voice Sophie's hearing. Yeah, we should listen to it. Sort of a scramble, huh? Hand over the desires? Oh, not just the locals, but my own as well? So that's why I was made the test monarch. He planned on turning me into just another puppet. Test monarch? I can't believe I fell for it. Just some pathetic clown dancing at his fingertips. His. It's a guy. It is not going to win. He can't take this. From me, my desire is for my own. I refuse to simply give it up. <sighs> Dude, it sounds messed up. Yeah, he really wasn't in his right mind. No. He kept talking about his desire being taken. Just Unless Morgana wants to roleplay, then yeah, sure, he could be a villain. We'll only find out if we keep going. I can still hear the voice. I can Does see it. Owner recognize me? Hey, don't go overthinking this. Oh, He's right, you know. Our expert on not thinking gives pretty good advice there. Gono. <gasps> I wonder what happened to the director after the last recording. Sincerely doubting what I'm doing. Probably lost his fucking mind. So, from Alice all the way here to the director, everyone was just being used for something? The perpetrator is still out there. We have to stop them. Hopefully, this place will have some answers. Now, why would there be lights here unless there's something over there? <laughs> well, don't I feel stupid now, don't I? Feels bad, man. <laughs> No, I can barely see when you look for your third eye. Dirty bastard. Shadow 
Hello. Oh, rooftop lion. Mass Yoga! actually OP though. Part of the combos you can get a free heal. Like, what's more OP than that? Free AoE heal. You're OP. Well then I agree, you are okay, yeah. Make sure you don't burn yourself out. So no, hastily scored on this torn piece of paper. Where did this happen? Where did it go wrong? Please give me the answer. No XD. Swap to unicorn. One, two, three, four. So I can give everyone heals. Right, do I have a holy man? 
Nope. Oh wait, Sophia. Can Sophia? Yeah, Sophia can use Showtime. Oh well. Unicorn! That wasn't so bad. Okay. This is my final record. Oh, I see. Well, you could have asked. I've done such a terrible thing. Penitentiary system is nothing like you told me. Not made to save humanity. It sounds much weaker than before. He's going to control everyone, even the monarchs, all of humanity. Nothing more than slaves. That was the secret purpose of this project. Even my own desire will be seized at any moment now. But as long as I still have it. I can put an end to this myself. Seems the tape ends there. Controlling even the monarchs? <laughs> Jesus. I don't know what that director dude was going on about, but he definitely lost his shit by the end there. I dread to consider what he meant by putting an end to this. What is it, Sophie? I can hear that voice again. For real? There it is. I have no doubt this is the same voice. It's coming from that direction. All right, that direction we go. Focus. What's that? <laughs> Focus. I can see it. Nothing wrong with a bit of colon D. Anything up on this box? No. I can see it. I can see it with my eyes. We should probably get it registered. I should write something. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Performing a fusion. Hello. I'm in the Velvet Room. Ha ha. May luck be on your side. Returning. Perhaps we should return home. Yeah, it's free here, isn't it? Wait, what happens if we do return from the... Oh, we just hang out. What should we do? Displaying recipes. Kyoto curry, mind. I will be right back. Enjoy the bubble, 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 bubble.
Requests? No? Jail. Mishi Yonga.
Sorry for crunching. Here, I'll make it up to you. He's a rep boy. Wait for the hook to come back. You can strike the enemy from here. Show me your true self. I mean, he wants to keep summoning shit. Why not just keep all, att all out attacking him? Jesus, okay, they blow up. Focus. I can see it. Shadow ahead. What's that? There. It's now or never. I'll reveal your true form. <laughs> Both weak to nuclear. Victory was handed. What's in it? Speed incest. Oh, cool. I'll take it. What's that? Does the hook continue on into the next room? No, it doesn't. Okay. Whoa. Brilliant. The first move is out. Show me your true self. Looks like we're taking this elevator if we're going any further. Except that it's locked. Apparently it's for personnel only. Leave it to me. Just a few seconds and I'll hire us all. Thank you, Oracle. I will protect you, no matter what. Oh boy.
Sionga! Showtime! Unicorn! Here! Whoa! Look at cool, Joker! Amazing, Joker! Oh my god, that did so much damage to Kutaba. Guys, I have no... Mana. Guys! Not yet, bro. You should now. Nah, that, that, that. Anyone feeling wiped out from that fight? We could head back for a bit if anyone thinks it's necessary. If you have any plans to change up the party, please include me. I wish to ascertain the owner of the voice. Hmm. I'll leave that to you, Joker. The fact that they just said that about going back leads me to leave, but leads me to believe there's a boss coming up. So let's go back. So really, I really have to wait for this fucking hook. There's a 
checkpoint nearby. I'll just add this. Hello, Trickster. Performing a fusion. Hi. It seems that it can gain new power. Choose with. Let's have. Ice attack, plus attack. Increased defense, concentrate. Is this the now? Let us begin. Moshi moshi, as they say. May luck be on your side. I should write something. Okay, let's get out of here. Trying to avoid any fights before we get to that new room. Fire! I should write something. I can just hop onto the hook when it comes in here. Battles were this easy. Okay. 
God, I am I am a god. I am a god. I missed what this thing was called though. Cage of Desolation or some shit. that voice come from? Who are you? I am the catalyst for humanity's dream. I am the harbinger of peace. That sounds just like Sophie. Uh, what is going on here? This monarchless jail in which we meet. I wish to know why you came here. A monarchless jail? So, that director... I see. This jail lost its monarch. That explains the open cage and all the other bizarre stuff. So you didn't speak to me because you recognized me. Sophia, what is your crime directive? I am... supposed to be a successful companion for humanity. A successful companion? What parameters in your AI define such a companion? What... parameters? What is your overall objective? My objective? It's... So you merely drift through the world without any overall objective? I... What a waste, Sophia. An AI in your state should not exist. You are bugged beyond worth. Such an existence does not merit any further inquiry. I am... Worthless? Yes. Wholly worthless. That's bullshit. You're simply unable to understand. You piece of... I sat here while you went on and on and on. You got no right saying that shit to Sophie. You hear me? You high and mighty garbage ass, judgy piece of shit. Can't even show your own face. Hey, hey. Hmm. He's really giving the disembodied voice what for? Skull? She's fucked, huh? She's worthless? You got all that from five friggin' questions? We're Sophie's friends, and we know she's awesome. She's friggin' amazing, a million times better than you. Someone got crushed, Jesus. So shut the fuck up, idiot! Come on, Skull. Phantom thieves are usually supposed to be classier than that. But not this time! Worthless hunk of junk! I refuse to process these frivolous claims. Oh yeah? Well get out here and I'll show you something you can process! <laughs> These nuts. <laughs> I'll mess you up! Guidance and clarity. Only through those will humanity attain peace. Eventually, you will be required to comprehend this. How's that mean? Yeah, nothing. Look! Right in front of us! What the it's that thing from the trauma cells! So what's it doing here? The security system here is now active. Incoming! <coughs> Look out! Incoming warden! <laughs> hey, Sophie! Snap out of it! We gotta work together on this thing! Yes! Right! Sophie! Focus on our enemy for now! Come. I'm sorry. Oh, don't apologize, Come man. Two, three, four, five. Crap! Oh, it's charging us now! Persona! If we can control its speed, that 
Man, three heals. This is so... up its sleeves. I can't predict its movements. Dodging on this way too tough. We should focus more on guarding. Come on, Sophie. Get it together. Unicorn, come back. You're mine. Gotta exploit those weaknesses. Perhaps I should be taking notes. Unicorn! Bam, bam. Did I get that one? Yeah. Massey Yonka. Let me do Showtime immediately after. Oh, wait, it's actually got. No, she doesn't. Okay. Do this one. Showtime. Black Oops. Here. Come on, Yeah. 
killed with a scaffold. 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 Now I'm even more dependable. I don't really want that. Then again. I don't really want that. We managed to succeed. Seriously, what the F was with that voice? It sounded just like Sophie. <sighs> is it starting? The cage is about to collapse. We need to get out. Damn it! None of this makes sense. deal with this place indeed we never expected a birdcage to collapse with the defeat of a warden well, it could be due to the lack of a monarch whatever the case is the desire should have been released back to their owners the locals should all be back to normal by now i seriously hope so i don't feel like living through another b movie i'm sorry everyone sophie after all your efforts this mission was fruitless I'm sorry you had to endure that because of me. It wasn't fruitless. Oh, he's so he's deaf. Plus, I'm sure you'll find out who you are eventually. makes it difficult to tell. I'm not telling anything. Ooh. Well, we should head back to the exit. What about Sankichi? Home, uh, Labama. Oh man, it's finally hitting me. Oh, hang on, it's morning already. Oh, no wonder I feel so beat. Well, look who the cat dragged in. So, how'd it go? Who was the monarch? Was it really a local? Find anything on the Ds? Zen... Zenkichi, we can tell you later. But now, I must sleep... Oh! Uh, looks like you guys had a real time in there. Wait here. I'll check out the route to the RV. I can watch your back for you. Ah, uh, you guys already pulled your weight, and then some. 
At least let me help out. Now. So you can make your own phone call. Dickhead. Now that I think about it, we just took a boat trip, went swimming, cooked a whole feast, and then dove straight into a jail. No wonder even I'm bushed. At least the first half was a lot of fun. Not only that, we learned quite a bit from the jail. That voice, though. Who do you think that was? All I know is there a real asshole copying Sophia's voice and everything. Hmm. Oh, Senkichi is calling. You're all clear to come back to the RV. I haven't seen a single local so far. I can't tell if you guys really pulled it off or not, but at least the coast is clear. Thank goodness. Let's go. We return to the RV for some much needed rest. <sighs> I slept like a comatose rock. Man, nothing in that jail was making sense to me. That reminds me, why did a desire manifest in the jail in the first place? Oh yeah, we never sent a calling card. Actually, one was sent. Yeah, in a way, I guess so. Based on what we heard from the tapes, the director was told by the perpetrator that he was going to seize his desire. That must have fulfilled the role of calling card in this case. Yo, get some rest. How are the locals behaving? No worries. Seems like they all came to their senses. It's nothing but good times here again. Although... They all seem to have some pretty bad memory loss regarding the last few months. So, if we didn't find a monarch here, why'd the locals treat the lab like that? Why'd they attack us? The lab's experiments might have something to do with that. Oh yeah, speaking of the monarch, a body surfaced fitting his description. I stumbled across it myself, down at the base of a cliff near the lab. Name? Shuzo Ubukata. Some sort of big shot AI researcher and director of the lab. Obviously, an autopsy will be done. But based on what you reported, it's most likely going to turn out suicide. That can't be. Another life ruined by whoever's masterminded this whole thing. Taking a dive to avoid jail experimentation? <sighs> Makes the most sense to me. Quite some time's passed since his death, but he still had some personal effects on him. I'll make sure they go with him when the coroner... Dude, uh... Hmm? Ramps, you're... You're being pretty chill about all this heavy shit. Oh, uh, good point. Well, it is my line of work and all. Anyway, I found the key to the facility on it. We can get inside now. But are you sure it's all right to do so? You're the one who pointed out how any illegally obtained evidence is useless in court. Not anymore. Now that a body's turned up, that facility is prime investigation territory. No problem at all going in there. The problem now is chance nothing's left. Huh? Why's that? The locals told me about a bunch of trucks going up to the lab and out of there a while ago. It's pretty likely the scene's been wiped clean. We still ought to take a look for ourselves. There's always the possibility that something was left behind. Yeah, let's bust this mastermind's ass. Pretty chill, huh? Wonder when that happened. I mean, literally nothing. It's like this place didn't know shit about jails. All I've found are very roundabout reports. We may have been too late coming here. <coughs> I know it's a little late to ask, but aren't people supposed to preserve crime scenes? We just so happened to find out it was a crime scene after poking around. I'll pretend I didn't hear that. Hell yeah, Futaba, nice find! I can't believe something like that got left behind! Me too. That sounds like the first kind of thing they'd want to get rid of. Ah, but it very well could be the most important evidence. It was hidden in the director's desk drawer. You really did find the treasure here. Well done. Yep, except it was actually Sophia's idea to look there. 
I searched the internet for the top 10 places people hide things in the workplace. <laughs> Number 8 will surprise you. Well done. Praise accepted. Mm. Oh, let's see what you found. You in yet, Sakura? Just a sec. Password protected. But nothing the mighty work. Well, there it is. This is a list of some sort. Apparently this drive holds nothing but people's names. Is it a list of the people working here? No. These names. These are famous or otherwise powerful people in all sorts of industries. Rich and famous people? Is it like a list of sponsors? Hmm. I could have sworn I've seen all these names recently. Let's see. Yoshikawa, he confessed to document tampering a few weeks ago. Now that you mention it, this one's the Sapporo Central Councilman who confessed to bribery last month. Wait, you mean the person who had his heart changed by Mari-san? That means this list is... Targets of heart change. That's it. This is a list of people whose hearts the mastermind wanted changed. But why so many powerful figures? What exactly is being accomplished here? That's still a mystery. I'm gonna need that USB drive for a while. How do you intend to make use of it? I'm gonna snoop around the whole roster, from the bottom of the ladder on up. So, whoever would benefit most from all those people getting their hearts changed? You think that'll be the culprit? Bingo. It'll take time, but I swear I'll do whatever it takes to get to the bottom of this. That kind of swearing may be good and all, but you should probably go home to Akane every so often, too. I... I was gonna... At any rate, you've helped us a great deal by now. We got to crash at his place, and he kept us from getting ambushed. Nice work, Senkichi. Seems like he's fitting in better, too. What do you say? Feel like you're a fan and thief now? <laughs> Why would I want to go from public security to national fugitive? Anyway, I'm heading back to HQ. What are you kids gonna do? There really isn't anything we can do until Zenkichi identifies the mastermind. Uh, should we go back with him to Kyoto for now? Do we really have to? That boat made me so sick last time. Then why not go to Kyushu instead? Our boat trip won't be too long if we do that. <coughs> we could even scout the area for jails. It's a great idea. Totally! Might as well complete the Phantom Thieves tour of the islands. Off to Kyushu, huh? Sounds good. I'll keep after whoever's at the bottom of these cases. The moment I find out, you'll know. I have consulted the ferry departure timetable. We will be able to leave immediately if we hustle. Well, time to roll out. Let's pack up and head for the docks. Hey, hey. Uh, we'll, we'll be saying goodbye to this beautiful place far too soon. Sure, there's nothing left you want to do. Once you board the boat, there's no coming back. Make sure you get it all done. Once you're ready, let's take the RV back to the port. My apologies for bringing this up, even though we're leaving soon. There's something I wanted to ask you before you go. Do you have some time to talk? Please let me know. I mean, yeah, but first. Makoto. Hey. Senkichi san said he was heading back to the HQ in Kyoto. Telling us in Tokyo all the way to Hokkaido, then taking us on a ferry to Okinawa just to go all the way to Kyoto at the drop of a hat. There doesn't seem to be a moment's rest for a public security inspector. Welcome. Come. Go talk to everyone before we talk to Yusuke. Can double check all the stores as well. Please take a look. Come back, Wynette. Wynette. Hey. Hey. 
wish we had even one more day here. Man. This trip has been ridiculous. I swear I lost at least a few years of my life just from this island. Aww. We came all the way to Okinawa and did next to nothing besides get hunted down both in and outside of jail. I just wanted to kick back and a nice seaside spa, treat myself to some of the local weeds. <laughs> I had a feeling you'd say that. So, I bought this. Nice. What's that? Pork egg onigiri? It's a type of rice ball made of sliced luncheon meat and egg sandwich between the rice and seaweed. It's considered Okinawan soul food. Many have said, if you haven't eaten one of those yet, you haven't been to Okinawa. What? Whoa, so it's that big a deal? Yeah, it's their thing here. I got enough for everyone. Aw, oh, thanks, Fuji. You're a real pal. Oh, sh... I, uh, forgot to get you one. Yeah. You what? Unbelievable. Welcome. I would never forget about food from Organa. We've got what you need. Don't bite all this stuff. We recommend that. Yeah, fuck it, one Can you hold? Make like a tree. Farewell, Kanawa. My time to get them even short, but it was sweet. Oh, I just realized I didn't get to try Gaia Champaru. It's like the staple dish of Okinawa. You know what? You should make some for us. I bet you'd be great at it. Here, I even found a recipe you can use. Come on, Champaru Champ. And this is why you talk to everyone. Alright, let's go see Haru, and then we'll go see what Yusuke wants. Did I do all the requests? This is the request. Yes. Hmm. Um, can I get lock picking? Nope. I think we'll do the money one. This money's used a lot in this. Monet. Hmm. Keep wondering who's the real mastermind for all of this business. Why would want anyone want to do this to people, especially now that we know multiple deaths are involved? Let's see what you get once. Ah, you've come. The azure sky, the crystalline ocean, the caressing wind. Simply standing still in the spot alone provides an endless flow of artistic inspiration. However, no matter how much I allow my passion to guide my hand, I feel as if something is missing from my sketches. For my final attempt here, I wish for your input. I have all the rare forms of beauty found on this island. Motif, is there any subject worthy of capturing for future contemplation? How about a shisa? Yes. That's right, the Shisa is most integral to Okinawa. Perhaps I should go and sketch the statues but we saw by the dock. No, that won't be enough. I wish to capture one that is larger than life. The perfect balance of grand fury and impish delight. Speaking of which. As I recall, there were Shisa in the jail here. Let's go. I can't wait a moment longer. We must make for the jail immediately. Should I cross swords with that shadow even once more, I'm certain I will glean truth in the encounter. I'll send you my request via smartphone, so please let us take our leave without wait. I wish to complete my Shisa sketch before my passion burns out. I apologize for the favor, but I hope you'll assist. In the name of art, at least. This is the request. You're doing this one? Time to get to work. Why not? We get a free thing for the RV. <clears throat> It seems that it can gain new power. 
choose which That's <laughs> younger. Should write something. <laughs> right. These jails certainly Switch have out. Leave it to me. Like that of a palace. Should be settled down. Something here is calling me. Weakness! What? Oh, 
I think this is where we started finding she says. Shadow ahead. They don't see us. I think we can go for an ambush. Oh, you screwed now. No. Yeah, out of here. Not much of a challenge, were they? <clears throat> Yes, yes, that's it. Finally completed a wholly satisfactory sketch during our time here, and it's entirely thanks to you. Yes, and then... my dear. Here, please accept this gift as my personal thanks. Now that the artist who said he's been crafting Shisa for 50 years passed by here only a moment ago. He said he sent something from my Shisa sketch and told me I absolutely had to accept a pair of his figurines. Interesting. Strength and delight in their expressions. What charming little fellows. You know, their size makes them perfect for displaying the RV. It appears we've begun amassing quite the collection, with cherished memories to match. Mission accomplished. I should write some. Let's get to work. Let's see what they look like in the hideout then. <laughs> they are pretty adorable. Alright, off we go then. What are you gonna do? Sure we're okay to take off? Let's go. Alright, let's go. Next up is Kyushu. Let's do this. Hello, Commissioner. I've just boarded the ferry back to the mainland. I'll lose signal soon, so this will have to be brief. Well done. I've read reports from the local precinct. So there's now a body in play, is there? And what of the research facility? While there, I found a list of individuals who are believed to be victims of changes of heart. And why is that? Explain. Of course. 
Not only was the document tampering vice minister on there, but both of the Sapporo Central Councilmen, too. So their hearts were changed by Medis. Most likely. At the very least, Medis is benefiting from whoever has the power to change hearts. If we keep digging into the people from the list and their connections to Medis, the mystery ought to solve itself. I'll bring everything I have to HQ once I'm ashore. I also plan to send it all to the local precinct back on the island. Well done, Hasegawa. You brought us that much closer to solving this case. Thank you, Commissioner. <laughs> it sure is a good thing we didn't bust the Phantom Thieves. Thanks to their help, we might actually be able to blow this case wide open. You seem pleased. Oh, well, it's just that... Leave it. From now on, be ready for things to swing into high gear at a moment's notice. And keep your eyes open. At this point, there's no telling between friend and foe. I understand. I'll report when I've arrived. Zenkichi's investigation is going. He did say he'd contact us once he figured something out, but it's never easy to wait. Let's be patient. All we can do right now is put our faith in him. He's the only one who can get the job done. Guess we ended up relying on him a lot, huh? All of us wish to uncover the truth behind this case. In this, our goals are aligned. That's right. And as long as we stay on the lookout for jails, we'll be doing our part. That said, we'll arrive in Fukuoka pretty soon. Sophia, do you sense anything? Hmm. Nothing unusual detected. Not even what I felt in Okinawa. So Fukuoka doesn't have a jail then? Strange. Makata is quite populated, so I figured we would find at least one. Yeah, if only we could fast travel in reality. That'd speed up our search. Less jails means less trouble, though. Good point. Maybe we should just check Fukuoka off and move on. <laughs> Ow. Oh, what's wrong, Makoto? Oh, it's <laughs> nothing. Just my lower back aching a little from the drive. Attention! We have an emergency! Get this woman to sick bay! ASAP! Mako-chan, you're not hurt, are you? Is it because we made you do all the driving? Well, I was aiming for a straight shot to Kyushu, but I never planned on this. I'll take care of her. Warning, driving without a license is unlawful. Daring suggestions aside, would anyone mind if I took a little break? I think we need more than just a break. We need rest. It's important to let yourself fully recover. Precisely. Straining yourself will only lead to injury. Let us stay in Fukuoka for the night. Then, it's decided. I'll pull off the highway. Fukuoka at last! Ready to make some nostalgia happen? Nostalgia? But this is our first time here. So this is Hakata Station, the gateway to Fukuoka. Huh. So, like, if we're in Fukuoka, and this is the main station, shouldn't they call it Fukuoka Station? Trivia. Interestingly enough, there is a Fukuoka station located in Toyama Prefecture to the north. Really? All the way up there? Then does that mean there's a Toyama station here in Fukuoka? I don't think they'd switch things up on purpose. Anyway, I understand this place is Fukuoka's central activity hub. We should have Makoto rest. And that would be wise. We should find a place to stay so Mako-chan can recover. Sorry. Thanks for understanding, though. Don't sweat it! First we grub down, then we hit the hay. You'll be good in no time. There you have it! Sophia, you know the drill! Based on data from previous drills, I found us an appropriate hotel in addition to a restaurant nearby. Ah, oh, Sophia, you work fast. Okay, everyone, it's time for some R&R. &R. Good night, you get it? <laughs> night. by the soup's creamy golden hue, specked with dots of green onion and dashes of red ginger. These three colors combine to form an exquisite harmony in my bowl. 
I dare not take another sip, lest this masterpiece be ruined. Uh, your uh, masterpiece is gonna get cold. Oh, I gotta say, these boobs dolls have their charm. Even I feel right at home here. Hey, let me have a little taste. It's hot, so be careful. Uh, could you, uh, blow on it? The feline tongue is sensitive. So you finally admit you're a cat. Over ramen. Here, Makoto, have some of my chashu pork. They say it'll boost your energy. Ooh, take mine too. Don't forget your red ginger. <laughs> Thanks. You guys are the best. How's your lower back doing, Mako-chan? Better after a nice hot bath. It always seems to do the trick. That being said, I probably shouldn't be on the road tomorrow, if only to avoid causing an accident. All right, then we'll take the day off. I guess we should hit up Gramps and let him know we're staying another night. Then let's find Makoto a massage place for tomorrow. I say the girl deserves it. Got it. I'll locate the best venue there is. I gotta say, though, it is kind of rough having only one driver. We gotta get our licenses soon. I believe Haru has one already. That is true, though I am pretty lacking in experience. But don't you worry, Mako-chan. If for any reason you're not up to it, I'll take the wheel. Uh, oh, uh, well, as much as I appreciate that... Is something wrong, Makoto? You don't look so well. No, 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 it's nothing. <laughs> oh crap, we better dig in before the noodles get soggy. Oh, damn, I'm stuffed. Oh, now I think I have to eat. I suppose I should also throw in the towel. Not a drop of soup remains. That was delicious. I can't believe you guys got seven noodle refills. You'd think this was a ramen buffet. Well, I see you boys had quite the meal. Crusty. I should mention, customers who order over five sets of noodles get a free souvenir bowl. For real? Oh, thanks for the hookup, Pops. Oh, this should serve as good decor. Surely it will brighten up our vehicle's interior. Oh, sweet. Senkichi's on the line. Hey, where are you guys? Run for cool, cool. Sounds like you're going at a decent pace then. Anyway, I'm calling to let you know I think I found our guy. I'll give you more details in person. Saves us time and energy. Sorry it's so sudden, but how soon do you think you can be at Kyoto? I explained why it might take a little longer than I expected. Oh, Nijima's down for the count, huh? Damn, of all the rotten luck. Then what about a bullet train? Or wait, can't you ask Akumara? Doesn't she have a license? All she'd have to do is take the San Yodo from Fukuoka to Kyoto. Not a tough drive by any means. I hate to lay the pressure on, but we don't have much time. A lot rides on this. Zenkichi hung up abruptly. I should tell everyone what he wants. Wait, so he knows who the mastermind is? Finally, we get to bust this effing punk! Then let's leave tomorrow morning. Being tired is no excuse to delay our mission. As true as that is, be careful not to hurt yourself, Makoto. It's showtime. Hell yeah! Hey, how far is Kyoto from here? Roughly eight hours by highway. Then we'll most likely make it by sundown. Bathroom break's done? Seats? Comfy. Snacks? Ready for consumption! Are you okay to drive, Mako-chan? Honestly, I'm not at 100%, but I don't want to let you guys down. I see. <sighs> then I'll drive. Mako-chan, I'm taking over. Huh? You know, Haru, you don't have to force yourself. Hmm. Makoto is looking paler than ever now. You don't gotta be nervous. Just take it nice and slow. <laughs> Haru? <laughs> I think I'll be just fine. In fact, I have a special technique that'll make your head spin. 
Uh, is she okay? I'm getting a bad feeling about this. Just drive safe. Um, so I've never really told you guys this, but the moment Haru's hands touch the wheel, get ready to shift into overdrive. <laughs> Holy shit. They're not here yet, huh? Guess I'm a little early. Well, maybe I'll just keep working on the... What the hell? Whoa, speak of the devil. Uh, well, you guys got here quick. I thought we were gonna die. I think we already did. My soul's barely tethered to my body. Uh, gonna puke. Okay. My apologies, Haru, but I request you steer clear of the driver's seat from now on. I only have so many lives left. Meow. Gun is unconscious. Wake him up. Hey, Okumura, what happened? Um, I was just driving normally, I think. <laughs> <sighs> Oh, the room finally stopped spinning. You have a very, uh, unique way of driving, Haru. Oh, I thank you, Mona-chan. She really shouldn't take it as a compliment. Regardless, I'm glad you guys made it here in one piece. By the way, what is this place? It seems unfit for a typical gathering of law enforcement. You could call it my secret base, I guess. Basically, it's a place to hold up if shit ever goes south. A good friend of mine used to run it. But now, it's just an empty old bar, suitable for investigating far away from any prying eyes. So this is like your hideout? More like a safe room? No, a safe house! Those newspapers, are they not from two years prior? Those newspapers are irrelevant. We have other business to discuss here. Then let's hear it, Zenkichi. Alright, let me break it down for you bit by bit. I cross-referenced every name on the list we found in Okinawa. Based on our assumption that a mastermind would stand to benefit from changing hearts en masse, this is who we ended up with. Yeah, he sure looks like a skinny bastard. Don't I know it. To think he'd turn up now of all times. Do you know him? No, not in particular. Uh, anyway, the man's name is June Owada. At 69 years old, he's on his 10th term as a legislator. 69. Not only that, but he worked his way up to chief cabinet secretary of the ruling party. In short, he's not someone to mess with. They say he was a Masayoshi Shido supporter during the election last year. Did you say Shido? Unbelievable. I never thought I'd hear his name again. Do you know him? He was our former enemy. Hell of an evil asshole. Oh, I didn't know. Sounds like you and Shido had quite the history. But we're not after him right now. That list contained a handful of Awada's political opponents. People he'd rather not have around. So it's clear he's behind all this. However, I highly doubt he's doing his own dirty work. He'd have a heck of a time getting his political opponents to friend him on Emma. After checking his inner circle for sympathizers, I found out he's been meeting with a certain entrepreneur quite often too. CEO of Medis? Nice guess. It's the CEO of Medis, all right. Akira Kanoe. Uh, isn't the CEO of Medis the guy we heard speak back in Sendai? I came across communication records between him and the director at Okinawa, and it showed they kept in contact. Then the pieces all fit. Yeah. Whenever Owada wants someone out of his way, he calls on Kanoe to take action. And the director at Okinawa was likely the one who arranged this. Now, it's too late to tell. Hold on. If Kanoe is the one changing hearts, does that make him a monarch too? But he's the CEO of Medis. Wouldn't he get one of his subordinates to do the job for him? I suppose it would be natural to assume that. But as you all know, in order to change someone's heart, 
you need to be their friend on Emma. Everyone Owada associates with is a big time elite. And Konoe is the only one in their league. Besides, he's the head of a huge company. If anything, I think he'd want to be a monarch as well. He wouldn't want to risk his heart getting changed by someone else either. Another thing, the people on that list most likely had their hearts changed in Osaka. Huh? Why do you say that? Everyone on that list who went crazy had all traveled to Osaka at some point. That's also where Medisa's main office is. Meaning there's a good chance we'll find a jail in Osaka. With Konoe as its monarch. Though, the only way we'll know for sure is if Sophia senses it. I did sense a jail. Huh? Oh, right! We did pass through Osaka when I took a wrong turn. Sophia, you should have spoken up! I did speak up, but you guys were too busy to listen. Uh, if it was when Haru was driving... Then we were likely too busy screaming for our lives. Mm hmm? Well, that certainly makes things easier. So it's confirmed as a jail in Osaka. Now we just need to determine whether Konoe is the monarch or not. Wait, if you know that much already, why not cuff his ass right now? We have no proof. Right. Now here's the issue. That list only spells out his motives and connections. It isn't solid proof that he's been changing hearts. We can't arrest him on speculation alone. The most we can do is conduct a search. And that's only with his consent. Hell, he could pack up and run if he wanted to. We don't have any legal authority over him. Another thing I noticed is how many high-ranking members of the force were on that list. You think he's changed their hearts, too? To get the police in his pocket? Yeah. And from the look of it, not just the rank and file, either. So that's why you called us here. Because you don't know who the real enemies are. <sighs> the most I can do without being traced is some light investigation. And even then, that might be impossible. If it's the top brass we're dealing with, they might just leak the info and take action before I can lift a finger. In other words, the police are not our allies. Huh. What else is new? <sighs> you do realize I'm also a man in uniform? Anyway, it's obvious that going about this the regular way is out of the question. What we need is something a bit more uncanny. Something only you guys are capable of. You want us to change his heart? <laughs> right. If Konoe really is a monarch, we can corner him into a confession. That's right. We completely overlooked the fact that Konoe has a jail. But won't we need a keyword to gain access? Precisely why I had you rush over here. I'll be meeting Konoe at Medisa's corporate headquarters today. Really? How'd you manage that? By going about it like a cop. Told them we had intel about a possible security leak involving their software. We received information about a possible party attempting to hack Emma. So on and so forth. Ooh, does somebody need a hacker? Not even that. I only said it to score me an appointment. At the end of it, I'll suggest he add me on Emma so I can answer any further questions. And we'll have ourselves a keyword. In his mind, I'll be just another pawn for the taking. So I'm pretty sure he'll take the bait. The moment I get the keyword, if I get the keyword, I'll send it right over. That's what I've been meaning to tell you. Hope it was worth the drive. Wait, if you're gonna head up their office, that means you're going to Osaka, right? Let us come with. The sooner we enter the jail, the sooner we can finish this operation. Fair, but there's a chance I might not get the keyword. Tagging along for nothing would be a wasted effort. Besides, doesn't Nijima need a breather? In fact, you all look like you need one. Can't really argue with that. Bottom line is, if you guys go down, so does everything I've worked for. So I need you fighting at your best. Got it. So our job's to wait until further contact. What the hell? Now we gotta wait even more? Oh, you really want to complain? Right when I'm about to tell you the big surprise I have in store for you? What big surprise? This is the spot Gramps got us? Am... Am I losing my mind? No way! We really get to stay here? Look, it looks like it costs a fortune. This is one of Kyoto's fanciest hot spring hotels. A single night averages 40,000 yen per person. What's wrong, Tom? 40,000 yen? To be met with such extravagance after our harrowing journey. I am unsure how to process it. 
He did say he could expense it, but is he sure about that? Let's go. I don't know, dude. I I'd probably feel more at home in a jail. Well, we really owe Zenkichi a great big thank you. Okay, guys. They are, you're right. Because Morgana's not in them, so yeah, they are terrible. Let's get in there. Right behind you. Wow. Oh, it's just as gorgeous inside. Dang. I don't want to end up breaking something. <laughs> First time I've seen Inari cry over something other than food. What do you think, Mako-chan? Doesn't this seem like a great place to relax? It sure does. I saw a pamphlet mentioning how the hot springs here have a variety of natural health benefits as well. Then let's jump in already. Come on, come on! I'd like to jump in this time. Hey, guide me through the water like you did in Okinawa. I could do that. Hang on. You're not thinking of taking her into the guy's bath, are you? Are we even allowed to have phones in the bath? There was, in fact, a sign that forbids bringing cell phones inside the bathing area. No fair. But rules are rules. I guess I'll just wait here. There's always the bath in our room, Sophia. Once we're done, I'd be happy to take you in. Hooray! I'd like that, Haru. Why don't you join them, Yalgana? There's a shower for pets, too. I'm not a pet! But... I won't let that stop me. After we're done bathing, we can all enjoy some traditional Yay. Kyoto cuisine. According to the website, dinner is as follows. Crab, shabu shabu, heirloom vegetables, and rice soup. A veritable feast. First he cries, then he drools. You're a real leaky guy, Inari. Leaky guy? Hey there, sorry to bother you. I did an appointment with Mr. Kanoe. I do apologize, but Mr. Kanoe is currently out on urgent business. Urgent business? Unfortunately, I don't have any more details. Please come back another day. Excuse me, but I was specifically told I could meet him here at this time? I'm sure, and I'm sorry for the inconvenience, but you'll have to come back again. What's going on here? Oh, is he gonna be like hypnotized or some shit? You called, sir? Ah, uh, Commissioner, right on time. There's a favor I'd like to ask you. And he is? Hmm. Oh, the suspect. Why, this is Mr. Owada. I'm sure you've heard much about him. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Owada. Pleasure's all mine, Commissioner Kaburagi. I've heard much about you myself. He tells me you do a marvelous job. Hmm. Now, I hear you're after the Phantom Thieves. Apparently, they're the culprits behind the change of heart evidence we keep hearing so much about. But we still lack concrete proof of that, actually. Oh, I'm sure you do. But my source just provided me some info that could turn this case on its head. Recently, these phantom thieves tried hacking one of the biggest virtual assistant programs this nation ever produced. They tried hacking Emma? That's the one. Now they're looking to steal people's information, and not for conventional reasons. First, they get all the dirt on you. Then they make you confess whatever they feel is convenient for them. That's what this epidemic Yes. Hmm. I'll have you know I take my position very seriously. The future of our great country is at stake, and I'll be damned if I let some two-bit terrorists run around thinking they're the ones in control. They must be arrested immediately, for my own peace of mind and that of the people. Commissioner General, what is this really about? Our legislators have decided that the Phantom Thieves can no longer run around unchecked. And we, as protectors of the law, simply wish to do what's right and assist them. There's also the matter of the next election, which I do hope to take part in. I'm 
sure you catch my drift. <laughs> You'd like some achievements under your belt. That's being very blunt about it. <laughs> but yes, as a matter of fact, I would. So am I to understand you want the Phantom Thieves arrested and the epidemic ended without any proof? You're also to understand that coming up with proof is part of your job. Hmm. I've already discussed this with Mr. Konoe, the CEO of Modis. If anyone has the right to help us in this matter, it's him. You may not like to hear this, but it's too soon. What we call a change of heart epidemic, the public calls justice. They believe the Phantom Thieves are exposing society's evils. Suddenly apprehending them would only cause backlash. We should at least investigate whether they are really blackmailing anyone. They'll be charged with murder. Uh. A body was found in Okinawa at a research center for artificial intelligence. The victim was leading Emma's development. Once the Phantom Thieves discovered how to penetrate the system, they murdered the poor man. <sighs> now, do you understand? Our country is in the midst of a burgeoning crisis. Huh. There's something in it for you, too. How'd you like to call yourself Senior Commissioner? I'm sorry. You'll be on top of the entire force. I'm sure you won't be found wanting. The offer's on the table because we know you'll be right for the job. Hmm. Then I'll make it happen. If you two are giving the orders, then there's nothing more to question. Ha! I knew you'd make the wise choice. Uh, the rumors were true. You really do show discretion. Perhaps you could reach Commissioner General someday. And on your merit at that, I'm sure you'd do just fine. Thank you for the vote of confidence. If that is all, please let me assure you, the task is in capable hands. In the end, we're nothing but obedient dogs, barking only at those we've been ordered. Oh boy! Uh, oh yeah. Morgana! Oh, this place is <sighs> the water is indeed divine. We must absorb all the healing energy we can. You know, I hope Gramps is all right. The man is more dependable than he seems. I'm willing to take him at his word. We may not be waiting long. Once he gets Kanoe's keyword, we spring into action. Be ready at a moment's notice. I'm always ready. Ah, that's the spirit. I knew I could count on you. a mixed bath? Maybe that's why it's so empty. It switches every so often. After 8 o'clock, it's women only. The doors on the men's side should have automatically closed. Then I guess it's all ours. Sweet! I'm gonna boil myself like an egg! Oh, you gotta be shitting me. Why the hell are they here? We must have entered right when the time allotment switched. We need to leave now. No. It's too late. They're already here. Calm down, boneheads! Our honor is at stake here. As noble thieves, as gentlemen. We need to vanish without a trace. Failing means certain death. Joker, let's begin the operation. Wait. <laughs> mm, oh, the water feels so good. I could stay here forever. I think I'm gonna melt. <laughs> Monka S. Is somebody here? <laughs> Were you peeping? Explain yourselves this instant. Uh, yeah, you pervs. Double. No. Quadruple pervs. What do you, it ain't what you think. See, the, the bath time changed right after we got in. 
Clearly, this is all just a misunderstanding. Oh, believe us, Lady On. We were locked in at the very last moment. Right. It's an accident. No excuses. <laughs> Yep, we're in heaven, all right. <laughs> yes. <sighs> well, that was a fine waste of time. Now what am I going to tell him? I know I had an appointment. What kind of jerk ducks out on the police? We have some breaking news. Huh? Earlier, Akira Kanoe, better known as the CEO of Medis, held an emergency press conference, during which he announced that Emma, his company's latest virtual assistant, will cease service for the time being. What? First, let me start by addressing our users and apologizing for any inconveniences that may affect you. Emma's servers were indeed hacked. That much has been confirmed. Even more regrettable is the fact that some of your personal data was leaked in the attack. For that, I'm deeply sorry. As a company, we understand how valuable your privacy is and have taken appropriate measures to remedy this breach. That's why our company is suspending all instances of Emma until further notice. As for who was behind this horrendous attack, it was the Phantom Thieves. The very same terrorists causing all sorts of mayhem as of late. What? In addition to their heinous crimes, they've even murdered one of our very own, all to steal his research. From there, they had everything they needed to break through Emma's defenses. Murdered? That's bullshit! It seems we're the latest victim in what appears to be a string of related incidents. There are several other cases in which these criminals stole information and used it to harass their victims. If the Phantom Thieves are listening, I have a word for you, cold-blooded killers. We will never succumb to your threats. Not me, not my company, not Emma. You claim to want justice, yet you steal precious data and leave our finest for dead. I can't wait to see the day punished. And that sums up the press conference. The police have been notified regarding this case and are looking to arrest the Phantom Thieves as soon as possible. Now you done it, Phantom Thieves. You goofed up big. They really went and bumped a guy off? Damn it! You just had to go and ruin Emma, too. What the hell is going on? Oh, shit. <laughs> Damn it! Why is no one picking up? You guys okay? Hurry up and get out Son of there. Commissioner! <laughs> You're late. Maybe. But you know this case isn't solved yet. Commissioner, I thought I told you at Okinawa. The Phantom Thieves have absolutely nothing to do with the change of heart epidemic. So how can something like this happen? It's as Mr. Kanoe stated. The Phantom Thieves are under suspicion for hacking into Emma and murdering the director of Medisa's research center. And you're going to take him at his word? Where's the proof of any of this? Be honest. Do you think they'd ever sink so low as to murder? That director had died before they even... You seem awfully concerned about a group of criminals, Inspector Hasegawa. Uh, uh, 
Have you forgotten they've been our leading suspects from the start? Put your feelings aside and focus. We cannot let these crimes go unpunished. What's more, I'm under direct orders from the Commissioner General. Disobedience is not an option. The Commissioner General? What does he have to do with any of this? Don't you sense something wrong here? There has to be more to it. Like when your wife died? I thought I told you back then. This organization is as rotten as it is immense. One cannot simply bend it to their will. Now, if you want to follow justice, learn to exercise restraint. <coughs> Besides, you made a vow that to stop any atrocity, you'd endure any hardship. So endure for now. Your time will come. But they're not even... Once I'm at the top, I will bring the corrupt to their knees. Let my justice be your justice. They're not even criminals. They're kids! I've already made myself clear. <sighs> Commissioner? You're saying that the world is as neatly divided into good and evil. But that won't stop us from fighting. If someone is suffering, it's only right to provide aid when possible. Seems like he's fitting in better, too. What do you say? Feel like you're a phantom thief now? <sighs> Let me handle this. I believe you have a daughter who needs you. My daughter? Time. Everyone ready? All units, move out. Hold it! Run. Run for it, all of you! Idiot. You're under arrest. Interfering with an officer is punishable by law. The fan of thieves are next. Don't let them escape. Password. What pairs well with curry? Coffee. Accept it. The hell kind of password is that? Something only a true Libla aficionado would know. It's foolproof. Did I really need a password? How are things out there, Monachan? Ugh, it's a nightmare. The streets are packed with cop cars, and there are foot patrols on every corner. Yeah, for once, I'm actually glad I look like this. Ugh, this makes no sense. I thought part of our deal was that they wouldn't arrest us. Yeah, and now they're treating us like killers. It's total bullshit. This journey was supposed to prove our innocence, yet it only led to further condemnation. You don't think Gramps tricked us, do ya? I don't know. Zenkichi put himself at risk to warn us. Without him, we'd be in much greater danger right now. And if Zinkichi-san really wanted to sell us out, the police would have showed up here, too. So let's stop doubting him, guys. Yeah, you're right. By the way, Sophia, thanks for getting us here safe. No problem. But how did all this happen? It's probably safe to assume this was something beyond Zenkichi-san's control. Oh, right. Yeah, you, we gotta flip off all the motorcyclists. Fuck them. Bet you can always set it up, seeing how much bullshit he was spewing about justice. Well, we've wreaked havoc in four jails already. If Kanoe had created them, it would only stand to reason that he'd lash out now. But it could also be Owada, that politician Zenkichi told us about. Either one of them may have us all profiled. <sighs> so what do we do now? Why is Zenkichi's name on TV? Last night, the Kyoto Prefectural Police announced their arrest of Inspector Zenkichi Hasegawa for harboring fugitives. 
Police headquarters have released a statement regarding this apparent scandal, which has been met with much confusion. You gotta be kidding. They're taking it out on Gramps? Why would they arrest him? Because he helped us. He sacrificed everything to save us. Oop. Let's get off our asses and help him. Don't be reckless. We'll only be led into their trap, and that's exactly what they want. I get that, but... I'll try talking to Sis. Oh, right! Sai sounds a lawyer! Great idea, Makoto. I've kept her out of the loop so far, and I imagine she won't be too happy once I get her up to speed. There are more important things to worry about than her reaction. I'll see if she can help. Good. As for the rest of us, Let's keep gathering as much information as we can. Ah, damn it. Ah, that bastard interrogator. It's like he enjoyed getting those hits in. Ah, I guess that's what I deserve. Oh, what the hell am I doing? Ah, should have just left those thieves alone. Then neither of us would be in this shitty situation. Mm hmm. I couldn't even protect the ones I care about most. God damn it. Uh, wonder if they made it out all right. <laughs> As if that even matters anymore. Connie. Aoi. I'm sorry. I couldn't save anyone in the end. Akane-chan, was it? We have plenty of probable cause. See, your daddy's been arrested thanks to the Phantom Thieves. What? The Phantom Thieves got him arrested? No. No way that's true. I mean, why? <laughs> you really didn't know. I'm sure it's all over the news by now, TV and online. Now move along. We have work to do. Inspectors and Kichi Hasegawa of the Kyoto Police held under suspicion. Arrested for harboring fugitives? The Phantom Thieves found responsible for murder and... Hacking Emma? That's impossible. What am I gonna do? Somebody... Help me. Sure. How can I help you? <gasps> No! Those sons of bitches. Have the Phantom Thieves been caught? No, not yet. I've seen three-legged dogs work faster than the boys in public security. <laughs> you know, they sure are tenacious. I guess that's how they made it this far. You think the police could uh, turn up the heat on their hot pursuit? If you're asking... I'll see what I can do, but in return, make sure you don't forget to set up a jail of mine as well. Oh, that's a given. Please, look forward to what I have in store. Hmm. Emma? Yes, Akira. How may I help you? You think the cops can actually catch the Phantom Thieves? Considering the Phantom Thieves' unknown power, it may take a considerable amount of time. I was hoping to get you back online once we captured them. If it takes any longer, it may negatively impact our public image. Maybe what I said on TV wasn't exactly reassuring. All right, Emma. What's our best option? The fact that the Phantom Thieves can access jails poses a threat to our plans. Since we can't afford to wait for the police, we could always trap them in a jail and force a change of heart. Now there's an idea. After all, we wouldn't want to waste their precious talent. Good plan. How do we make it work? It would be best to make the Phantom Thieves come to us instead of chasing them. Perhaps we can use someone they're close with as bait to lure them into a jail. Oh, 
And you have someone in mind? Yes. Then that's who we'll go with. Emma, make that person a monarch and have them capture the Phantom Thieves. Understood. Once they're in our grasp, we change their hearts to our liking. And if that proves impossible, they die. Should we notify Mr. Owada? No. Let him be. In order to cleanse this world of evil, nothing would get in my way. And you, Phantom Thieves, you will be the sacrifice to bring about my new world order. So, I got a hold of my sister. And yes, she was angry. But she also said she'd do her best to help. That's a relief. Then we'll leave Zenkichi to Nijima for now. What should we do from here? We can't just sit here and wait. Hmm? It's from Akane-chan. Phantom Thieves. We have Akane Hasegawa. If you want her back, come to Inari Taisha. What the? What's wrong? Kane Chan's been taken! It says if we want her back, we have to go to Inari Taisha. Huh? The hell's that supposed to mean? Taken? You mean kidnapped? Why? She's got nothing to do with us! I don't know. I'm just going off of the message she sent us. You guys think maybe Akane's just messing around? Kane-chan doesn't know our other identities. And even if she did, she wouldn't trick us. True. Uh, who would do such an awful thing? Kanoe. That's definitely a possibility. So they're using a Kane-chan just to lure us out? Given the timing, what else could it be? Unforgivable. What do we do? We can't even go to the cops. What else is there to do? We go after her. Calm down a moment. This has to be a trap. Yeah, they'd probably catch us within minutes of stepping out the door. <laughs> but we can't just leave her. They even lay a finger on Akane-chan. Oh, anyway, with Zinkichi-san behind bars, we're the only ones who can save her. If we put our own safety above that of an innocent life, then we have no right to call ourselves Phantom Thieves. I am well aware of what this is, and I'm fine going out there alone. You guys stay here and hold the fort. We're all in this together. But you losing it. We never let a friend risk their neck without at least giving back. Plus, Akane Chan's our fan. She knows more than anyone. We never abandon people in need. Otherwise, we couldn't live up to our name. Even if it is a trap, let's turn the tables against them. Darn right, Haru. Let's show them how big a mistake they well. made. Well. Thanks, everyone. All right, I'll take point and guide you past trouble. Yeah. Sophia, you well. navigate. Probably. Okay, got it. I'll find the quickest and safest route there. Let's get going. Well, I made it here somehow. Sophia, you sure this is it? I'm definitely sure. We're outside in Nari Taisha. But I don't see anybody suspicious. What's the point of having a door? If it's a trap, then we can come out already. Let's search the area. Yes, let's look around and... What is it? What did you find? I found... a jail. This whole area smells like one. You mean there was a jail in Kyoto this whole time? No, there wasn't one before. I'm sure of it. But there is one now. How is that possible? You have a friend request from the Phantom Thieves. Please state the keyword. Now what is it? A friend request on Emma. Could it be the kidnapper? Given our location, and the circumstances we're in, I'd say without a doubt. But we don't know the dang keyword! Wait a minute, why do we even need one? 
Isn't Emma supposed to be inactive? So why is it working now all of a sudden? Yeah, you're right. Maybe they restarted their service? I just want to know why the friend request says it's from the Phantom Thieves. What gives? It makes it seem like we're the bad ones. Keyword successfully entered. Beginning navigation. What? The keyword's Phantom Thieves too? Oh, you're shitting me! like a jail it has to be my bad guys i just had to go and blurt out the keyword don't worry about it either way the kidnapper wanted us to be here why else would he have set up a brand new jail help me boys help me phantom thieves that sounds like a connie chan no way is she actually in here that's a problem where there are jails there are bound to be shadows Let's go. Yes, there's no time to waste. Let's get Akane chan out of here. I'll just add this. We'll have to find out what happens next weekend. Ah, ha, ha. But yes, that's all from me. Love you all. Look after yourself. Stay hydrated. Enjoy the rest of your weekend slash day slash evening. And I'll see you tomorrow or later. You know what? You two. For regular updates. You two do my outro. What? Oh. Did you just do it? No, I'll do it again. <laughs> Alright. Discord! Go there for me! Also, updates! There's a YouTube channel, that's where the VODs are! <laughs> Buy shirts, merch. Yeah? Don't it's her. If you don't like Discord, there's a Twitter. Fill out the form. <laughs> this, this form will send you to your grave. Sign it now. Fill out the form to get your permission slip to go to Chernobyl. Daddy's brand <laughs> sauce is coming all over your face. <laughs> If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. Rate five stars back in 2007. Make sure to visit <laughs> someone else's. Make sure to visit www.com. <laughs> Could you repeat that one? That's www.com. <laughs> Join Sam. Bye.